Shalom, soldier most high in Christ, bless. Yes, yeah, shalom, uh, soldier most high in Christ, bless. Why did you join IUIC? Well, I joined IUIC because um, I always knew I was uh, an Israelite from the old class that I used to go to. I went to a, a school where some brothers was teaching, and they was Israelite brothers, and they showed me that I was uh, an Israelite. They more or less set the foundation for me, and one day I was watching, um, I was on uh, YouTube, and I was watching a class, and IUIC popped up. It was uh, Elder McDaniel and Barack Shah. And the things that they was teaching in the scriptures, it didn't line up with what I was taught. From what I was taught, it wasn't lined up with what uh, Israel United Christ was teaching, which was Elder McDaniel and Barak Shah was reading. And from that point, the things that I thought I knew in other words, didn't line up with what IUIC was teaching. And they showed me that um, Christ was, was black in the scriptures, which the class that I came from showed me that, but they believed also the, Christ, the class that I came from that um, they believed in immaculate conception. And IUIC taught totally different. A lot of stuff they taught different. And I um, compared what they was teaching to what I was taught before I saw them and I left that group. And from that day I've been with IUIC. I met, uh, I didn't meet him in person. I got in touch with Deacon ASAP. And from Deacon ASAP, Deacon ASAP introduced me to now is Captain uh, Ryan. And from that point on, I've been with IUIC. I started with Captain Ryan in, in his basement. How long have you been congregating with IUIC? Uh, about 10 years. What made you decide to look for the Most High? Well, I was. Like I said, I was before I got with the uh, group before IUIC. I always believed in Christ, but the Christ I believed in was what I was taught by my parents, and I was taught that he was a white guy, blonde hair, blue eyes. And then when I got with the group before IUIC, they uh, were showing me that. Christ was a black man, so that really made me wanted to see Father because I was able to read it in the scriptures myself. And that's why I uh, was seeking the true Christ, because I thought that that's what I was doing from what I was taught from a kid. But I come to find out what, I, what my parents taught me wasn't true. What scripture sealed the deal for you to walk in the truth? Matthews 19, 16, 17, where it says that um, what do you have to do to get into the kingdom? And that is to keep the commandments. And I try my best to keep the commandments as it is shown forth in the Bible. What makes you continue to stay with IUIC? Because they teach more of the truth than any group that I have seen on YouTube and it's only two groups I've really been with personally and that's IUIC and the group that I was with before IUIC they just set a foundation for me and when I got with um, IUIC it's more the truth they brings the Bible I could say to life even to today's standard from the past to the future. Quote your favorite scripture. It's, like I've said, it's Matthew 19, 16, 17. It's, um, 
uh, when one came to Jesus and asked him, what must I do to get into the kingdom? And he said that um, you must keep the commandments in order to get into the kingdom. So in other words, also it would be uh, Matthew 14, verse 15, where it says, if you love me, keep my commandments. And I tried my best to show Christ spiritually that I love him by keeping the commandments. Nathaniel of Israel United in Christ. Please subscribe to our YouTube channels. Stay up to date with our latest events, music, and classroom lessons. IUIC plans to continue visiting different countries where this gospel has not been preached before. IUIC needs your help in pushing this truth. So join us, subscribe to our Instagram, Facebook, Twitter, and podcast, and stay up to date with us. For more information, please visit www.israelunite.org.